Welcome, y'all. So the latest spiritual attack to me came through a dream, and demons love to attack through dreams. So this was after I put out that video about the um, ban that's going on, and there was still a little bit of passion running through me, and I just set my head down and went for a quick nap after that. And the first one was I stepped outside and there's this fire. And some of you who know dreams may be able to interpret this, I don't know. But there was this fire and around the fire, it was just total black, uh, which was very hell-like where even though there's fire, there's no light. And I heard this growl, like a kind of a scary, like a wolf growling. I couldn't see the wolf, but it was there. Now, my interpretation is that it was a challenge. And so instead of running back inside or turning for a weapon, I run down towards the fire. The wolf starts charging at me. And instead of staying on my feet, I slide down to be on the ground, even with the wolf, to make myself even more vulnerable. And then I go and I kick, I slide and kick the wolf. And I make contact with the wolf, and it's just like a pillow. And at that point, I wake up. And my heart's kind of pounding a little bit, but I woke up after that. Uh, my whole feeling on this was bring it on. I wanted to humiliate the wolf so much that uh, through my non-respect, putting myself on the same ground as the wolf, and in the end, it turned out to be all for show. Um, and then, so that was attack number one. And then attack number two, I was in front of my grandfather, who's passed on since now, and he comes and he starts charging at me. And this man, when I knew him, was so kind and, and so loving. So it was completely out of his character, but he was just enraged and just was fixated on me and coming after and, and just accusing me with all these things. And he just kept like coming after me. And it was arousing like this animosity towards him, but I knew it wasn't really him. But it was just so intense and so accusatory that I just was like, wow, what is this? And eventually I woke up. This form of attack is actually common. Uh, you yourself may have had this form of attack where you'll have a parent or someone in your family and you're, it usually starts off where you're having a conversation and then their faces turn. And when their faces turn, they turn into like this demonic entity. And some sometimes they stay in the right face, the same face, and they, their voice changes and they just start coming after you and accusing you and trying to fight you. Uh, in either case, you see the demonic manifestation, either through the voice or the change of tone or just how they really drive after you. And so demons love to use your family and your kin because what this does is it it opens up this trust with you and it also gets you kind of emotionally engaged because you recognize their face you uh, recognize you know their tone of voice you recognize how they look how they're presenting themselves so you literally you open up to them and there's that that tie you have to them that soul tie and so it's really a way for them to work themselves in and attack you and again this is all about trying to move your emotional center from god and get you scared and all this kind of stuff but i knew at this point in my life that it was a spiritual attack i woke up and called on jesus christ to come in to heal me and he did and it was awesome so y'all that's the latest spiritual attack apparently there is something going on spiritually i think it has to do with my recent some of my recent talks on here, but also talking to certain people about Jesus Christ, and uh, they really don't like that. So thank you all again for tuning in. And also, I appreciate I appreciate y'all's comments, y'all's uh, words of encouragement. Thank you so much.